Hello, I'm Green. And I'm Purple. And this is Rex, and she has something to say. That... that was everyone from Central Park. Including Lorraine. Oh, you had to bring that up. <laughs> what? And you're saying that Lorraine's a part of that thing, too? Yeah. I thought it said a hundred at first. I was like, what? <laughs> that thing a hundred? I'm sorry, Daniel. Mm. Uh, yes. That's become apparent. That's what medication Melissa had been taking. What was she on? Advil. <laughs> what? <laughs> All this because of freaking Advil? <laughs> it was a bad batch. Oh, goodness. She was being administered immunosuppressants. Immunosuppressants? For what? Why? Upset stomach, diarrhea. She started taking Pepto. <laughs> <laughs> My editor just names like eight different medications. <laughs> I'm oh, driving at the speed of sound again. I won't sing it again. Thank you. Here's the story. Melissa had a transplant when she was a kid. Transplant? What kind of transplant? Yes, it seems that she got one of your sister's kidneys. After Maya died in an accident. A kidney transplant? So Melissa got Maya's kidney. That should be our kidney! We're taking it back. <laughs> a good song. Your mother and your sister were donors. What? Really? I never knew that. Your mother's organs couldn't My be tran- oh, Your mother's organs couldn't be transplanted after the accident. So Maya's kidney was transplanted into the young Eve. No, I'm sorry, the young Melissa. She had kidney failure. Then Eve's kidney is really Maya's kidney? The intern that was present at the operation was... You guessed it. <laughs> <laughs> Hans Clamp. Our main man Clamp wanted to become a donor. Doctor. Yeah. <laughs> the doctors that were present during the operation were all surprised and... They all screamed when that the kidney was hot. She's playing hot potato with the kidney. <laughs> <laughs> Then, Eve is... It's hard for me to say, but the Maida. original... <laughs> God dang it! It's hard for me to say, but the original was present in Maya. Eve killed the host brain, cultured the kidney, and obtained their own physical body. Then that's what happened to Melissa. Luigi, stop farting! <laughs> in her case, the music present drug served to act as a catalyst. In Japan, Eve tra- targeted a girl who had undergone a transplant kidney transplant, to be exact, and she was taking the same immunosuppressant drugs. This was also that Eve would have a uterus to plant the fertilized egg. In order to transplant organs, it is necessary for the HLA type to match. It lives symbiotically with other cells, so it's necessary to take immunosuppressants to control the immunity and avoid rejection. While being controlled by Eve, Melissa felt her body change. But she finally got the lead part in the opera. If she had gone to a doctor, she would have been told to give up the part. So in order to avoid rejection, she kept taking the drugs. And after taking so much, she was so weak that Eve was Maida. able to... I'll get it one of these days. <laughs> she was so weak that Eve was able to take over her physical body. And that's how she transformed into mitochondria Eve. Wow, you guys figured out a lot of stuff. I've so... just been listening to him. <laughs> Uh, so then, Maya is... Maya's the original Eve. In reality, it's Maya's mitochondria. And that's why... And that's why Rex has it. Yep. Uh, dot, 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 dot. Oh, I figured, figured out story stuff. Mm-hmm. It's all coming together now. Oh, hey! Roger! Commencing operation, sir! Finally, the time has come to put our power to the test. Uh-uh. <laughs> Don't be impudent, Winch. It shouldn't come down to this. Yes, sir. Forgive me, Admiral. Call our final jets. We have just received permission to attack. I think you gave... Never mind. Commence operation. 
It's kind of a clampy voice. No, you gave the, like you gave the captain an old man voice, <laughs> and then the <laughs> admiral. Commence operation. Head for the Statue of Liberty. I was like, how that work out? That's planned. Helicopter Team One will prepare for Plan Two. Team Two will search, and the rest will do their best to impede further advancement. Yes, sir. What was Plan Two again? I don't know. Figure it out. <laughs> going down. It's getting serious. They're gonna nuke us. What? No. What? That's the... That's that's just their plan. It's like, well, it's lost. Nuke it. Just nuke New York City. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Jeez. Oh, look at... I swallowed at, my spit right Look at that spike. Ugh. What? Are you sure? That was a quick phone <laughs> call. <laughs> the Navy's made the move! <laughs> it's like, What? It's just like, there's this show called Garth Marenghi's Dark Place, and that's how phone calls go on that show, because they're supposed to be, like, purposely bad acting. What? There we go again. We can't allow this. We'll be repeating what happened yesterday with the Jets. We gotta stop it. Too late. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't they learn from yesterday? Nope. What are you talking about? They're they're humans. They're stupid. They don't learn. Sir, I'm looking at something that appears to be, uh... I don't know, it looks like some sort of Snickers mass. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Is the Snickers? No! No! Lorraine! Lorraine can't be a part of that thing! The huge creature. Or no, those cells. That must be where he's giving birth. Where she's giving, where, where, where she's she giving birth? Oh, where she's giving birth? Yes, the huge creature will act as a barrier, protect the ultimate being. There's some really sweet organ music going on right now. <laughs> hey, organ guy, can you like calm down a little bit? Oh, sorry. Sorry, I don't get to play that much. <laughs> they better, yeah. Let's get close to it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, that one guy got away. No. What? Oh my god, we are so stupid! I mean, in their defense, this is like the best we have. They, they don't realize that we have to oh, use no. crazy magic powers. Are they it, gonna get hit with their own? Mmm. Yeah, so basically, uh, that thing is like a guardian. It's protecting Eve so she can give birth properly to the ultimate being. Gross. This whole situation's a little gross. Lorraine! The helicopter's coming! Oh! oh, oh. Everyone, Doc, cover your heads and. Doc, get cover! <laughs> Why aren't you guys getting down? <laughs> Shut up, Maeda. Seriously? Shh! <laughs> Be quiet. Oh, what happened to the organ music? <laughs> Officer Bree of the NYPD, correct? Man, it's my duty to come to you, the aircraft carrier. Come to her? To what? Can we stop saying what every five seconds? Is it okay to cover my head? Yes. Can we stop by my place? No. Can I change the clothes? No. <laughs> Wait, why? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, which one with the Admiral? Welcome aboard the Navy's pride and joy in the Nimitz. What? I'm Williams. I command this ship. Sorry to have you come on such short notice. You just switched their voices. Did I? Yeah. Hey, you better not put Rex in danger here. Oh god, no. <laughs> um, you yeah. gave the captain the old man voice, but you switched it, so now the Admiral has the old man voice. All right, well, that's how it should be, so we're going to leave it there. All right. You, who do you think you are? Talk to the Admiral that way. It's quite all right, Lynn. After all, he is right. What? What do you mean? Stop saying what? Oh, gosh, I can't keep track of these names. Williams? Okay, Lynch was the younger one. Wait, Williams, who's... Williams the old one. W wait, Williams is the is the Admiral? Yeah. Okay. You're the only one that can't be ignited by her. I'm asking you to get in our chopper and nuke the creature. See, I told you it was going to be a nuke. Hmm. 
Hold on. Rex can't fly a helicopter. Um, says you. I, I really can't, though. <laughs> I was just trying to seem tough. So. Not to worry. Chopper's been set to auto. She won't have to, any problems. So, so she just needs to fire from a distance where she can't be ignited. Fortunately, the weapon needs to be fired at close range in order to work. This is a plot device making you get closer to the monster. <laughs> and we cannot move in that close since we will be ignited. Another plot convenience. <laughs> well, if it helps the plot... <laughs> I'll do it. No way, Rex. You're not going up there. You're not my father. Our fate lies in your hands, Rex. Yeah, see, Daniel? See? Okay, Daniel? You gonna calm down now? Mm, that thing. That's not Lorraine. Yeah, no, it's not. Do it for Lorraine, too, Rex. Nuke her. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, please, Rex, take this. Uh, what is it? Come off it, man. We don't have time for that right now. It's a love letter. I mean, uh, no, no, nothing. <laughs> yes, of course, uh. Rex, please be careful up there, okay? Of course. I'll be fine. Oh. Here we go. Gotta buckle up for safety. So, uh, actually, uh, Rex is gonna change clothes. Well, she's not gonna change. She just took off her jacket. So, I mean, it's a different... <laughs> it's a different character model. Maya. This is all your fault. <laughs> Why did you die? <laughs> Once again, I have to clean up your mess. Here we go. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Are we gonna fire in the helicopter? No. Darn. That would have been cool. That would have been bad. There's no room. Yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> no, I mean like we control the helicopter and just like fly around and shoot at her. That'd be cool. That would be, but... Still sounds hard. Let's call Square Enix and have them change the ending of this game. Yeah, sure. <laughs> He's all goopy. Quit doing what I'm doing. Quit for me to do. What? Wait, can you repeat that? <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> can you talk? That's Formation 2. Okay, it's a straight <laughs> line. <laughs> what? What's happening? What's happening here? Formation 2 is a straight line. What do you mean? Can't, I can't understand you. Oh, this is a horrible idea. Well, I'm not sad he's dead. Didn't you die? Oh, God. What? No! I'm not doing this without your... Did we just die? No, they did. What if I run? Prepare to <laughs> That voice. All right. Please move away from me. Now! We got a man out there who's like, all right, we're right. Okay, we get it. Shut up. <laughs> God, can I turn this thing off? Jeez. Run and run and Shh, be quiet. <laughs> Shut up. Thank you. Thank you. We got gooped. Oh, gross. This is insane! Since Christmas Eve, I put, on, I put a curse on my own body. Why me? Why is this happening to me? I, I don't understand. what I do? Why me? You had an awful but sister. <laughs> I don't care anymore. Because Eve, I'm the one that can destroy you once and for all. Maya, I'll end this and let you rest peacefully. You know she means it, because she moved her head a little bit. <laughs> I have a feeling the nuke's not going to work. Yeah. It's just the Kids' Choice Awards. <laughs> <laughs> we just got slimed. The thing is, um, actually, no, it actually did work. It did work? Mm-hmm. Did we just mess everything up, I guess? Right. You, um, we blew up the Guardian. Mm. Yeah. But Eve is still inside. Yeah, Eve is still fine. But, uh... You'll see. 
Oh, there goes Statue of Liberty. Dang it. First Cloverfield and now this. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, the nuke, for the most part, did work. It did blow up the Guardian. Uh, we did it! Well done. That was magnificent. Her turn to base, Rex. No, it's not over yet. It's just the thing that every villain says at the end of the game. It's not over yet! You, the yeah. Kid. We did blow up the Guardian, but Eve is still alive. Great. But we did... Yeah, she's still alive. Gross. You're gross. Oh, you little bitch. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get it now. <laughs> Rex, come back now! It's too dangerous to continue. Turn to base at once, we will plan. You don't sound that concerned. <laughs> but... Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, we... Yes! Why would we not want to say? Wait, okay. Let's cut it here. Because oh, okay. after this, we are going to be fighting Eve. Alright. Come back for that, everybody. Bye, everybody. See ya!